What's up guys, my name is Ed Admani, here to give you a quick update on what was moving markets last week and what to look out for this week. We're nearly one week into March and so far so good. The three major indices all bounced back last week, posting gains after having a pretty rough February. And a special shout out to the S&P 500 for snapping a three week losing streak, making investors proud. Right now, the vibes are pretty good. But don't pop the champagne just yet because the brief bull run could come to a screeching hall this week. The economic calendar is jam packed this week and we're gonna learn a lot about the economy. On Tuesday, Fed Chairman Jerome Powell is going to be testifying in front of Congress. And then on Friday, the Bureau of Labor Statistics, they're going to be releasing the February jobs report. It's kind of a big deal. We're going to find out if the job market is still scorching hot. See, the job report thing is kind of weird because low unemployment is a good thing, but it could also be an indication that we're going to have more inflation coming up which is not a good thing. So hawkish remarks from Jerome Powell or super low unemployment rates might spook investors and kill the good vibes on Wall Street. We're gonna have to wait and see. Earnings season is wrapping up, but we still got some companies reporting earnings this week. Three earnings to keep your eye on. Ulta Beauty, Dick's Sporting Goods, and BJ's Wholesale Club. That's all I got for you today. Have a great week. And if you're a nerd like me and wanna know what's happening in the markets daily, be sure to check out the Moneyline app.